Hi, I'm Lina Majorga and this is Sensei. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, I'm a fashion designer and a stylist and I love K-pop and of course I love fashion. For today's reaction, we have Yuna with a new music video that is called Nabilera and I'm excited. I really love her so much. She's engaged. Let's see what she's gonna be wearing. Sensei is gonna be reacting about the butterflies because Navi is butterfly, right? In Korean, so let's get started. If you are into fashion, fabric, color, everything in between, accessories, please subscribe and give this video a like. Let's get started. Thank you. So Yuna and Navilera, let's get started. I'm expecting a lot of color. Okay, what do we have here? Butterflies, of course. Yuna with this hat, safari style hat. Okay, really short shorts and skirts. This really bright blue, light blue. And look at the dancers, they're matching with the denim set. Okay, a lot of prints, really bold looks. Like, I feel that this is Yuna's style for, it has been for a while. These like really mini skirts, mini dresses. Like, look at this, we have a sim simple T GCDS that is like so popular for music videos and for this type of music, this like pop, you know? Like it's so like cherry pop, that type of style. And the shorts are tiny, but I like the flare on the sides. Oh my God, the makeup is amazing. I love makeup and the makeup is really great. So great. I feel that also with the cap is such a Yuna look. We have a bomber jacket here with a Tom, like Tom Ford sports bra and shorts. I like it. It's like so many styles in one single video. We have the school girl here, simple A-line skirt. You see, it's like more like simple, basic. And then we have something as crazy as this other look with the denim boots, uh, latex dress kind of thing here, a lot of embroidery, but that blue is such a specific blue for Yuna and Dawn. I feel like it's their color. But so many accessories, beading, the beading details for this music video, the accessories, really like, wow. So many looks, it's hard to count them, honestly. It's so hard to count them. I really enjoy when the stylists pay attention to the looks for the dancers, you know? Because they really, you know, they are occupying like the entire scene, so you need to dress them well too. Like this is such a bold movement here, you know, just the scene is so bold. I'm loving the jeans a lot, loose very baggy with the corset it's you know it's the look for now she looks great i'm really really liking the accessories the beading pieces oh my god it's just like so fast and so many looks that i couldn't count them honestly i couldn't let's go back we have the first look that is like the safari style really hard to um, explain it in my opinion i really love the hat the makeup is amazing the print of the top is mm, not of my liking but as i mentioned before that blue is like so like yuna it's like so yuna and dawn i feel like reds like hot pink almost red and that specific shade of blue is Yuna. It's Yuna and Dawn, they have mm, used and managed to adapt those bold colors for every single video. 
um yeah in terms of fabrics it's just giving me like okay bikini with these these shorts this not of like scallops yeah you know i don't know if i like them honestly from here to the top i really like it but that's it it's like the makeup for this music video is amazing look at that the accessories is so bold yuna has become like a really bold artist um yeah of course it's really the songs are like so pop that it requires something like this uh but she definitely has a style she definitely has a style that if we see someone wearing something similar we can say that oh you look like yuna you know like that's something that yuna will wear because it's definitely a silhouette that is like really short with bold colors, bold prints, or bold accessories. So we have how many looks so far? It's so hard to count them. Honestly, I prefer this look with the straps on, uh, with the orangey straps. <sighs> yeah, I don't know, honestly. The makeup is amazing, in my opinion. I really like it. There's so many looks, and as I mentioned before, um this like cherry pop if you know if you are a k-pop fan you know what i'm talking about that cherry pop look that is like kind of lolita but like cheerful ball pretty colorful but i don't know it's, it's sexy sexy cute yeah lolita i'm just in shock with the makeup i'm loving the dancers looks um it's just like oh, so much that I'm like a speechless, honestly. Of course, what are we seeing here? We're seeing um, special pieces, like those shorts. You don't really see the, those type of shorts uh, with the flares on the sides. But it's really, it's mixed really well with the simple tee. And you see like the dancers, they're cheerleaders. They have like this type of uniform. Um, it's, it's aesthetically pleasing, you know? It's bold, but it's not messy, you know? There's so many looks. No, one, two, three. Oh my God, look at the shoes here. The platform shoes. Oh my God. <laughs> this is also like so Y2K. So it's just like so many styles that it gives me a headache, but I like it. Is that normal? <laughs> also here, I, I, I have to say that I really enjoy seeing Yuna wearing something like this that is more like on the urban side um, with the boots. The boots are amazing. I really like them. I want a pair of boots like that. We have seen them, of course, but they look amazing, honestly. And the dancers, okay, I like it. We have really baggy and like oversized tees. And we have like some sort of belt to cinch them on. But otherwise, it's just like the same silhouette, the same style. I like that. What else we have? Definitely my favorite look has to be this one with the Tom Ford set um and the bomber jacket it's nothing crazy but it's because i haven't seen you know wearing something like that in a while that's why this is so cute this is just like gossip girl type of look you know um anyone can wear this look i love it uh i see myself wearing that the skirt is so simple uh, I wish they have done something else. Maybe not pleats because it's uh, like predictable, but something else, something with the treatment of the fabric for that skirt will be cute. I don't know, something. It's missing something, that skirt, in my opinion. It's so simple. Um, but the balance, it balances really well the background too. So I like that. Like in contrast with this look, oh my God, it's like so many looks, so many looks. And look at the dancers, so bold too. 
Oh my god. I really like the song, honestly. I really like the song. What do we have here? We have a bodysuit and on top we have like a over piece that is basically embroidery. Should we consider these like accessories? I would say so, but since it's like a full body, full body uh, piece, in is part of like the clothing, you know, the clothing category. And then we have those like boots or like, yeah, how can we call them? The denim part with the jeans uh, cut off, um, so popular. We have seen so many with the rising of upcycling, something that I do to uh, I upcycle so much. Uh, that's like my main thing as a fashion designer, upcycling. Uh, like organic vegan fabrics so a way to recycle jeans is to create a piece like that but it gained so much popularity that designers denim designers or like designers in general started creating pieces that resemble boots you know with the legs of the jeans do I like it? I don't know. Something about the the pink thread is not of my liking. Um, but I really enjoy denim in any way, any type of form. Um, the guys are wearing jeans too. This is such a statement music video, honestly. Because they didn't... Like, they weren't afraid of showing anything different. Like we have the the really tan guy that is not used to be seen in the K-pop industry, and the guys without the shirt, uh, showing the boxers. It's just such a statement. I I'm loving that. I'm loving that. The looks are not like. Like, I wouldn't be like, oh my God, I want to wear that. I want you to wear that. No. What can we take from this music video? Oh, my eyelashes falling or something. <laughs> what can we take from this music video is that you shouldn't be shy when choosing colors. When choosing colors and choosing accessories. Be bold. For Yuna, it's about being bold, mixing fabrics, experimenting with fabrics, with embroidery, many sets. That's something else that is like so Yuna. Having like a set. Same color for the top, same color for the bottoms. That's so, like That's her style, in my opinion. I love sets. Sets are easy. I think everyone loves sets because you can look pretty well put together if you have a cute set on. Um, but I feel that with this music video, we can take that we can wear more like body jewelry, like incorporate body jewelry into your outfits and be bold about color, especially now that we are in summer. Um, like you wouldn't expect denim with like that body jewelry piece, uh, but she did it. And of course with the butterfly theme that is more like, you know, like butterflies with so many colors. Of course we have the darker ones, but there are so many beautiful butterflies with really bright ball colors so um, they went that way uh, and we have this one it's just like i just wonder like what's the team behind it like what made them choose to select so many looks because it's like so many looks so many different styles like what was the point i'm loving it because i have a lot of theme you know topic here to talk with you about this music video but i don't know if it was necessary i don't know if it was necessary um 
this look is okay i like it something else that we haven't seen yuna wearing lately so i enjoyed that um of course yuna is like sexy you know she's recognized in the k-pop industry as this femme fatale uh, that is not shy about her body um her music of course so um, i like that like she's not tacky that's the thing that's something that we can say about yuna that even though she's wearing bold stuff and like really sexy and mini dresses mini skirts mini shorts the way that the style is and also the way that she dresses just like herself um it's not tacky at all it's it's i don't know the way that she balances everything is to the right point it's like silver lining but you cannot compare uh yuna i shouldn't compare yuna with anyone actually but i'm telling you this is this sexy style but i think it's because she mixes that sexy style with this lolita sweet girl cherry pop pink like light blue it's because she's mixing that sexiness with that that is not falling in the tacky style in the um, not tacky but like you know it's like too much you know especially for k-pop for korean the korean style for girl groups or for girl singers you know female singers um yeah i think it's that i think it's because she's mixing that sweet uh sweetness with the sexiness um so many prints so many beatings oh my god i'm just in shock the music video is so bold i like it i'm not gonna say that i don't like it um because i was able to see so many looks um do i want to wear one of those looks i don't know maybe i will wear some pieces from different looks like i don't know it's just like so many i lost count it's like seven looks or something for how many minutes three minutes seven looks it's just insane in my opinion seven eight looks i don't know how many i have to count them and i'll tell you when i'm editing this video but it's honestly it's insane but i enjoy reacting to yuna's videos and done because it's always so bold and unexpected and i'm always like okay what are they gonna wear are they gonna be wearing like many known labels and are they gonna be mixing these like fabrics um different types of fabrics and of course they never disappoint me in terms of just like opening my mind to new things and of course if i wanted to see color yuna is giving me color so guys what do you think about this music video i will say that is pretty bold and you can take from this music video that you can wear color and that maybe let's look for more body jewelry maybe that can level up our outfits so that's something that we're gonna take from this music video okay and uh, guys give this video a like please don't forget to subscribe he didn't say just went to bed he's near me but he wanted to say thanks for watching don't forget to follow us everywhere fashion fab news on tiktok on instagram please subscribe turn on the notification bell follow kitty sensei everything is down below all the links don't forget to join our patreon community lina majorga and if you want to see my designs if you want to see what type of fashion i create you can always go to my website linamajorga.com and my Instagram, lina.majorga, my TikTok, lina eh, Majorca. but you know everything is down below, please follow me there, if you want to see more fashion, read more about the latest fashion news, go to my blog, fashionfabnews.com, guys, thanks for watching, leave me a comment down below, telling me which one of the seven, eight looks, I don't know how many, was your favorite, 
uh, and read about my favorite look in the comments. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. I'm Lina Majorga. Till next time, don't forget to subscribe. Bye bye.